Hello Terraria Enthusiasts, my name is James and welcome to day two of our Terraria Christmas adventure. So I hope you enjoyed day one, thank you for all of the amazing uh, comments that I got. I asked you yesterday about your Christmas advent calendar and I was actually really surprised. So many people, like there was honestly like a good 20 people were like, yeah, I got a Kinder Chocolate one. I didn't even know they made Kinder Chocolate advent calendars. I would have got a Kinder Chocolate advent calendar. Like, Kinder Chocolate is the bomb, right? I don't know if you ever had a Kinder Egg, because I know they're illegal in America, but the actual chocolate itself, oh my god, it's the absolute best. So, like yesterday, if you look in the description, if you're first, you'll find a code for something. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to put in there today. I feel like I want to put some Dryad codes in for Dungeon Defenders too, because I've got loads of those left over. Um, from the developers, which was actually really nice. And I was meant to to distribute them over, I can't remember, it was a while ago. <laughs> I got given them, but that's what I'll put in today. So if you do win it, let me know. Let me know. And uh, and keep the, the thread about the advent calendars going. I want to know what your advent calendars are like. So today is the first episode of the higher quality stuff that I mentioned. Uh, I was going to do it in 4K, and then I tested it out, and I, uh, and I showed a bunch of people, and I was like, what do you think of this? And then I showed them 1080p, 60 frames per second. They were like, yeah, no difference for Terraria. For other games, though, yeah. So, higher quality either way. I'm very, very happy about it. So, in today's episode, in day number two, uh, behind the door is more exploring. I don't like to rush the beginning of the game because I, I find that the best part of Terraria for me is exploring and finding chests. I feel like when I do the whole, you know, rush to the Eater of Worlds thing, it can get, I don't know... It takes the fun out of it, so that's what we're literally doing. I also asked you guys yesterday about what houses we should do, so I got some great comments. Uh, mostly, the the biggest one was a Christmas tree house. So a giant Christmas tree with the baubles, or ornaments, I don't know if you call them baubles elsewhere in the world, but the ornaments are actually the NPC homes. I like it. I want to try and, I don't know, I want to like, I don't know, I want to get some mods and try and build that first and try and work on the design first so when it comes to actually building it like you know it's going to be good but i feel like i want to test that out so i feel like i'm, I'm going to try a, a little speed build of it soon and then i'll post that as a separate video and then one day you'll come on and <laughs> there'll be an amazing house hopefully i feel like that's the way it's going to work but we'll see we'll see so i, I do really appreciate all the all the ideas though uh, Christmas tree was just without a doubt just the most popular. I also saw an idea for a uh, oh snap Oh, no, 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 no. Oh God, did you know cuz I don't have a grapple hook I also saw an idea for a, uh, a chippy snowman So a snowman with a red hat on it I thought that was really clever and I thought that would be kind of cool And then we'd put like James the Clothier next to it. I feel like that'd be awesome Right, so the ice biome's not working out as well as I hoped I wanted to go this way because it was kind of more empty, but I feel like I'm gonna go here. Oh look, there's actually a- up. Oh! <laughs> I, I forgot that it's icy. There's actually a, a traveling merchant here. Uh, so we'll ask him. Well, not a traveling merchant. They're called- what are they called? Bone merchants? You would not believe some of the pings people throw at me. Wanna buy some of it? That's actually a reference to World of Warcraft. Fun fact. Right, well, you know, there's not actually too much I would actually buy from this guy. You know, I would buy the counterweight. But, and I was like, oh man, that's actually really good. But then I'm thinking, well, I can't exactly use it because then it's not Christmassy. They don't have a Christmas, oh my god, a bauble yo-yo. Oh, someone needs to mod that. But I'm thinking maybe some of these because then maybe we can uh, get some gems. I don't know. It, it seems like an alright idea. We'll see how it works though. So I'm going to put this here. I've got so many great weapons. I'm just not sure how to use them. But I feel like ice swords are definitely on the table. Although, somebody uh, made a good point, right? But they were being sarcastic. But it was it was really funny. Um, so obviously I said yesterday, oh, we can't use the Star Fury. Well, he said the wise men, you know, followed stars, right? You know, that's how it goes. So, I don't know. That is a pretty Christmassy thing. <laughs> but no, we're not going to use it. But I thought, you know what? If there was ever a reason, that's it. Well, this is actually becoming quite difficult, to be honest, because there is a lot here, a lot of a lot of bad people, and I'm slipping everywhere. 
Right, I'm just gonna dig down and see if I can stumble across anything decent. I want like a, a wide open area to uh, to mess around in. So this is probably gonna be our first bit of obsidian. Yeah? All right, okay. So one of the things I wanted to get done today is I actually wanted to set up a, uh, I don't know, like a very basic AFK farm, just the, the simple lava trap ones that I've used in the past. So a bucket of lava would be very, very handy. Now, I don't have a, a furnace on me or a, yeah, or anything like that. So I might have to go back to the, the top of the world and go and get that stuff. I never crafted it yesterday. Whoa, there we go. I never crafted it yesterday, so it's not like I can just quickly go and get it, but... Hmm. Oh, do you know what? I actually never knew you could blow up obsidian. That's actually new to me. I thought it just kind of, uh... It just kind of stayed there. Oh, but that's hellstone. Ah, okay. Right, there used to be a little technique where you could, uh... Use a bit of dynamite and some hellstone to make a, a really cool little explosion trap for the wall of flesh. And that's what I was getting confused with. I could really do with... I could really do with some grapple hook. So that's why I'm collecting gems whenever I see them. Or at least I'm attempting to. I get lazy, I will admit. So let's put this up here. And let's go up like this. Okay. So what is up here? Probably just a bunch of, uh, a bunch of nothing. But that's alright. We'll see. Okay, so I know sometimes, like, when you see these little ones, like that and that, you know they're probably going to be gems, right? So what actually is it? Is it a topaz? It's a topaz. Let's see what gems these are, and then we'll, uh, you know, we may blow up some obsidian. I'm not too sure. I feel like that'd be kind of cool to blow up some obsidian. I don't know what we'd use it for, though. Obsidian helmet, maybe? But then... I don't think we'd really need it for that. I guess you could always make a uh, an obsidian skin potion. And then you could literally dive in hell. But, uh, I don't know. Maybe that's why obsidian could be blown up. Because when you think about it, it's not actually that useful. Right, I'm going to take this stack. Is that a stack of diamonds? No way. Diamonds are very, very rare. As I learned in my mage series here on Chippy Gaming. But <laughs> wow. Wow, that was great. What a great stack. <laughs> oh no. And we've had no Christmas presents today, sadly. None so far. I can really do with some. Maybe I should go and uh, slaughter some more enemies. Oh, there is dynamite here. Where's the, um... Oh, it's here. Is that enough to kill me? Uh... Oh wait, why didn't it blow up? I don't get it. That should trigger it, right? Oh! Oh, okay. It froze the game for a second. It was like, nope. Okay, I'll take that tin for whatever it's worth. Probably just a bunch of scrap. And I'll start going this way. I'm killing jellyfish along the way to try and get some presents. Although, it's honestly really hard to kill jellyfish because they have that uh, immunity frame, don't they? So, it might take a while. To kill all of these fish. So I'm hoping blowing into this uh, marble biome is going to get me something. Oh, do you know what it might get me? Dead. <laughs> so I'm going to run out of air in a second. Ah, okay, let's get up here. And... Oh, breathe. Nice. Okay, there's nothing worse than letting that breath counter go down, is there? Oh, do you know what? I was like, what is that? I was like, that can't be a jellyfish. I've only been away for a second. Oh, no. Do you know what? I always look at these enemies and it reminds me of one thing. When Python was doing a hardcore fisherman challenge, he was sat- Oh, a present! Hey, there we go. When he was doing a hardcore fisherman challenge, he was waiting along in a, uh, in a little, I don't know, like a little hole that he'd made for a, uh, doing some fishing. And one of those crept in because they became, uh, they can go through walls, can't they? And it just, it just killed his hardcore character. And obviously, hardcore, one life, you know. Ah, oh, God, glad he is. Okay. Sorry to freak out there, but I was... Oh, God, I realized how low health I had. And that's one gold gone. So while I'm here, I got a bucket, and I'm going to get myself some lava. And then we can try to help this kind of thing. And we'll do, like, a little, uh... I don't know, we'll, we'll test it out, see what happens after, like, I don't know, 20 minutes or whatever. Oh, I might not do that today, actually. Oh, I don't know. 
That's a hard one. I got some stuff to do today, that's why. <laughs> I ain't got 20 minutes for a, uh, an AFK farm, at least. You know. I got 20 minutes for some other stuff. But I don't know if I might do that today. Maybe tomorrow. Ah! Oh my god! It took me forever to get down here as well. Jesus game. Okay. It's not very Christmassy, Terraria. Oh my god. I bet you my present is going to be a lump of coal at this rate. You know what? We'll open it up. We'll wait until I respawn. We'll open it up. What have I got? Alright, okay. I'm, I'm happy with that. <laughs> at least that's decent. Oh, should I set up the farm now? Go, go on then. Go on. I'll set it up now. And we'll see what happens. So, what I need to do is I need to essentially dig underground a little bit. I'm going to do it... I need a, sh a nice straight air, uh, a nice flat area. Well, I guess it's kind of straight, isn't it? Straight floor. <laughs> and I actually, do you know what? I need something else. I need one of those little uh, hidden doorways. Uh, oh, look at you, Terraria guide, doing it well. Okay, let's grab one of these bad boys. A trap door. And then I want to do it in an area where I'm not going to ruin forever, but it might have to be here. Okay, get down, get down, get down. Is that enough? Okay, trap door. And then what I'm gonna do is give it one of these and one of these. Thin this area out with a bit of lava. Whoa, there we go. Easy enough to jump over. Got one more present. Boom! Candy cane block. Hell yeah. Burp. God, right. See, I'm that kind of guy. Right, at least I close the door. Right, and then what you need to do is mine over here. And hopefully, they will come underneath and try and get you, boy. Okay, let's do... Let's do this. So they, they still come along. Let's see, does that work? I just want to test this out. Yeah, that kind of works. Yeah, because it, it kind of... I don't know. Yeah, that, that works. I guess it's harder for the eyeballs because of the way I did the blocks, isn't it? Yeah, okay. I did the blocks wrong for that. Come here. If we extend them out a bit. So if I do it like this. Make the lava a little bit thinner. This might ruin it. I'm sorry, guide, but I don't think you're making it through. Actually, my lava trap might save you a little bit. Uh, extend that to there. And do that. Like that? Would that work? I'm pretty sure it would. Come here. We'll do this. And then I'll leave it. I'll go away. And then I'll take a 10 minute break or something. And we'll see. I'm interested as to what will happen. Because I feel like this could work. I don't know why I'm delaying this. I'm just really... I'm trying to make sure before I leave, it will definitely... <laughs> Push the guide in! Poor guide. Oh, wow. Okay, let's see how the eyeballs react. This should go a lot better than before. It depends on how they want to arc, really, doesn't it? Oh, really? Oh, come on, eyeballs. What if I do it to there? There you go. So now it will definitely reach in. Nope. How about there? <laughs> this is hard to do, because you need to get it perfect for them. To do their perfect arc. What about that time? Nope. What about here? Are you going to do it now? Really? Come on now. It's like watching that thing on old DVD players that used to like bob around saying DVD. And it would have to perfectly sync up with the corner for you to leave. Oh, come on, man. Should I do it to here? Or is that too thin for the lava? See, that would work. Right, there we go. Okay. Right. Little break. I'll go make some coffee or whatever. And we'll see what happens. All right, I'm back. I probably left that on way too long. Uh, I was enjoying my break too much, right? <laughs> Let's see. Five presents. You know what? I'll take it. Considering I was doing uh, absolutely nothing at all, uh, I'll take it. So, hmm. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to make a parkour 
section across like this because otherwise I will burn my tootsies all right let's go across like that there we go awesome okay let's get rid of that rope and that there we go all right well that was pretty baller open these up one two three four five Oh, I like the holly. I've actually got some holly on my door um, in the real world, which is the first time I've ever done that. That's new to me. Oh, look at that. Another present. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'll take that. What's it got? Boom. Candy cane block. Like, we're, we're on our way. Haven't had a weapon yet, weirdly enough. You'd expect to have a weapon by now? Ah, oh, well. Ah, oh, well. Does not matter. We've got some good weapons anyway. Right, well, let's put loot all, deposit all rather. Right, let's see. I want to slaughter some slimes, but I also get, I want to work on a grapple hook. And I'm trying to think, how many gems do I have? I don't think it's enough. Let's put away some of this stuff. So I've got eight amethyst. How many, uh, do I have any gems in this one? i got six sapphire. So no, no, I don't. Oh. oh, that's a shame, actually. Now I'm trying to think of where I want to go next. I want to go into that granite biome there and then continue around here. So I'm hoping here uh, there's actually like, oh, no, I threw one of the good glow sticks. Oh, man. So I'm hoping here, like under here is going to be some more chests because granite biomes are usually pretty good, aren't they? Oh, no, 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 no. I get very overwhelmed. Ah! Gladiators! I get so overwhelmed here. There's a lot going on. God, gladiators, man. I don't know how many times I've run back here today because I keep dying on the way down. Oh, no. Okay. Don't worry, guys. It's attempt number two. <laughs> I'm not going to get caught out by hoplites. Fingers crossed. Okay. Slime, piranha. We can deal with these. These are basic. And a present, nice. Whoa, okay. My Terraria keeps like stopping for a random second. I'm sorry, because that must be very frustrating. I'll, I'll try and figure out why it's doing it. But I feel like it's just Terraria. Terraria is like that. Not very well optimized this game, unfortunately. But whatever. Okay. Blue jellyfish. Get him slain. Okay, we even have glow sticks and health potions now. Ah, I can oh, ho, ho, what a clutch. What a clutch. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. That was a clutch. That was a real clutch. I managed to get right back into that water right at the end. I don't know why, but I was treating it like I had a, uh, a cloud in a bottle. <laughs> so I ran in like, huzzah, I'm going to get some stuff. And I didn't. Oh, it's a crab statue. Okay. Well, I'm happy with the, uh, I'm not going to lie, I'm happy with what I've got so far. But, that said, I would like to, oh, one sec, let's finish that guy off. Okay, I would like to see if there is some more up here. Uh, okay. It's nice to have the uh, the cloud in a, in a bottle, not the cloud in the bottle, the red balloon. Uh, anything else up here? No. Oh, wow. I don't usually get that. Granite biomes with that chest. Quite rare, for me at least. Ah, but then again, you're, uh, you may vary based on mileage or whatever. Um, oh my god. Look at this. You see this, you see this ground here. You see this, uh, this like red, uh, it's moss, essentially. It's moss. Um, it's funny, because every time I see it, I remind myself how excited people were. Oh, my. I feel like that's it for today. <laughs> I feel like that's it. But I remind myself how excited people were to see moss for the first time. Because moss in Terraria was, like, the first thing they added when they did an update. 1.1? 1.2. And it, people had waited uh, two years for the update. That's the first thing they saw was moss. Okay, a Christmas pud. Right, today's not been extremely successful, but I'm happy with that because I had some fun. Hope you guys did too. 
Um, I'll see you all tomorrow anyway, because it's, it's Advent Day 3 tomorrow. Um, remember, if you do want to try and win one of those codes that I leave in the description, there is way too many of you to uh, to give away too many games, right? Essentially, I can't afford it. Um, but if you have notifications on, you really are th in for a treat, because notifications genuinely are the quickest way to get to the video first. YouTube is very funny. Like, if you're subscribed, it might not put my video onto your subscription page for half an hour. Uh, it happens all the time. But... If you have notifications on, it's straight away. So you click the bell, it's next to subscribe, you click on alerts, there you go, you might be in for a chance. Right, have a great day everyone, I'll see you all tomorrow for day number three. Peace.